San Francisco Public Works just received a $350,000 state grant to help combat illegal dumping. And the focus will be in the Bayview section of San Francisco, where toxic dumping is a major problem. Stanley Roberts takes a look around the Bayview to show you just how bad that problem is in this edition of People Behaving Badly. You're looking at the reflection of a fence on a bucket of motor oil. This bucket was illegally dumped on the street. The sad part, this is a common event if you happen to visit or live in the Bayview section of San Francisco. There is a lot of illegal dumping that has been going on in the Bayview for several years. And while some people have found a way to make good use of illegally dumped items... You could use a cushion but <laughs> and a TV. <laughs> the dumping appears to be getting worse. Because now a lot of the materials dumped have a toxic twist to them. For example... This 55-gallon drum just appeared one day, and it's full of some unknown substance. Right next to it, this rusting metal container, also full of some kind of liquid. And this container, the metal appears to be slowly eaten away. This box is full of used fluorescent light bulbs. The box reads, contains 60% less mercury, but still contains mercury, no doubt. A lot of this stuff appears to be building materials like old marble countertops, bathroom tiles, and other things. In some cases, tons of highly toxic material have required a hazmat team to do the cleanup. It's costing taxpayers millions of dollars a year just for the cleanup alone. In San Francisco, Stanley Roberts, Cron 4 News.